Free school bus service starts today for Lahaina students to get to class in Central and South Maui. But to catch a ride, families first have to enroll their students temporarily at the designated school. So Wailuku Elementary or Kamali'i Elementary and Lokelani Intermediate, both in Kihei. Yeah, so to enroll, go to the new school to fill out enrollment and bus application forms. Or you can show up at one of the bus stops to get those forms. Pick up and drop off locations are at Kapalua Airport and Whalers Village. The DOE says that there will be security at pickup and drop off locations, and DOE staff will be on board the bus to, quote, support students' well being. In one week, Lahaina Luna High School begins meeting at Kulani Hako'i High School in Kihei. Unlike the elementary and intermediate schools, Lahaina Luna students do not need to enroll at Kulani Hako'i. But families are encouraged to sign up for bus rides in advance. We're going to post a link at hawaiinewsnow.com. DOE Superintendent Keith Hayashi says that Lahaina schools are still on track to reopen after the fall break. That's mid-October. Today, Hayashi will provide the Board of Education an update on the impact of Maui's wildfires and how the school system is supporting students. Meanwhile, the Star Advertiser reports that the DOE is still trying to contact about 500 students. 3,000 were enrolled in four public schools in the Lahaina area. This amid concern and fears about the number of children who may have been killed in the fire. So far, two child victims have been identified, with just one of them having been officially identified by police. Today's meeting is set for 1 p.m. at the DOE headquarters in Honolulu, but there's also an option to attend virtually. We'll post that link on our website.